This Wednesday is Juneteenth, the day meant to celebrate and commemorate the ending of slavery. While they do have some events planned for the holiday itself, the BG Freedom Walkers held a three-day-long celebration at the Soki Fairgrounds to help get things started. WBKO's Sarah Phipps was there for the final celebration today to get more information on the event and how the Freedom Walkers have used it to bolster black-owned businesses here in Bowling Green. This weekend was the Beachy Freedom Walkers' fifth annual Juneteenth celebration of freedom, taking three days to celebrate black history, excellence, and educate on the holiday. But with Juneteenth, uh, it was Gavison, Texas, uh, June 19th of 1865, when approximately 250,000 slaves were free. But it's important to Bowling Green and to the BG Freedom Walkers to spread peace, love, diversity, and unity, um, to unite our African American community, as well as our allies with other minorities and with our local own small business owners as well. The celebration had plenty of entertainment, including a Miss Juneteenth pageant and an artist showcase, as well as stands for black owned businesses and eateries like Wrap It Up. It is a uh, boat lettuce bar, a family owned business, family driven and family own. The kids do help me prepare the food uh, and uh, we're just here to give uh, give the community something different to eat. Something uh, besides your regular food or what you have around. It's a healthy option. Jay Mallory, owner of Wrap It Up, stressed the importance of providing healthy food and resources in predominantly black communities. So, I mean, my big thing is we have to take care of ourselves. We only have one body and uh, we have to take care of it. And what we, starts with what we put in it. You know, we can exercise all we want, but if we don't eat a little bit healthier, then, uh, you know, what's the point of it? Karika Nelson, founder and CEO of the Freedom Walkers, encourages everyone to get involved and participate in Juneteenth celebrations. Um, so that's a big thing that I hear all the time, that they think that due to them not being African American that, you know, well, maybe we shouldn't come or, you know, maybe we shouldn't register. No, please come. We accept and want everyone to participate in our community events. Um, it doesn't matter the race or your ethnicity. On Juneteenth proper, the Freedom Walkers will be hosting a free showing of hidden figures at the Capitol Theater, the first in what they hope to be many Juneteenth movie nights. Reporting in Bowling Green, Sarah Phipps, WBKO News.